Hey guys, John here, Toyota finally teased the long awaited Grand Highlander. Let's talk about it. So I was scrolling through Instagram earlier today when I saw that Toyota USA posted this. Of course, a very dark photo with nothing really to see, but they said sophisticated, spacious, and powerful. Our grand plan for Highlander is coming February 8th, 2023. Conveniently, a couple days before the Chicago Auto Show, so we most likely will see it there with a debut. A little bit before that, who knows what Toyota's gonna do yet, but let's talk about the photo. So Toyota, of course, gave us a very dark photo, but let's go ahead and lighten it up. So we lighten it up and let's zoom in on the lower left of the Highlander, sorry. Grand Highlander. So let's zoom in on the lower left of the Grand Highlander. And what do we read first? Well, it's what we're gonna talk about first, the powertrain. We see Hybrid Max down there on the lower left. This is the same motor that is in the new 2023 Toyota Crown. And it's also the same powertrain setup that is in the Lexus RX 500H performance. That one's souped up a little bit more, more horsepower, more torque, but the one in the crown is 340 horsepower and around 400 foot pounds of torque. Lots of torque. So that hybrid max motor is a 2.4 liter turbocharged motor. We have an electronic rear E axle. It moved the Toyota Crown, and the Toyota Crown, I believe they said is about 4,400 pounds. So that four cylinder motor, hybrid tech, an electronic rear axle, all wheel drive, just it actually scooted. So for this platform of this Platinum Grand Highlander, you should expect it to move it pretty well, especially if they tune it up a little bit more, and most likely a standard engine. It could be a hybrid as well, just the Toyota's next generation hybrid system, not the hybrid max. So this being an SUV platform for those forerunner owners and lovers waiting for the sixth gen, further confirmation that this whole powertrain or something very similar to it is going to be able to push a heavier vehicle. So now that we have the lightened up photo, we know what the powertrain is, at least of this Platinum Grand Highlander. Let's go ahead and look at this one and an existing 2023 Highlander side by side. Now the Grand Highlander most likely will be a 2024 model. So not sure if the current Highlander is going to be refreshed for 2024, but these two rear ends, completely different. The current Highlander on the left-hand side, bit more bubbly for sure. The Grand Highlander on the right-hand side could easily be mistaken, especially in a darker setting for a Toyota Sequoia. So very edgy with the Grand Highlander on the right-hand side. A big third brake light, it looks like. The taillights themselves are more square like a RAV4. You have Grand Highlander written out in the center right under the Toyota badge. And then the whole just rear end of it too, with the reflector lights in the bottom bumper, it just looks so much different, so much more chiseled. It's a very nice rear end compared to the Highlander that is there right now. So we can expect this Grand Highlander to give us more room in the third row seats, more cargo space too. We're not sure yet if it's gonna be wide what the front end looks like. Everything is just who knows right now. But we got the teaser from Toyota and what we know so far, completely different rear end and also the hybrid max powertrain. So those are the two things for sure we know and that its debut will be in February of 2023, most likely right before the Chicago Auto Show. So guys, let me know what you think down in the comment section about the Grand Highlander, the Hybrid Max powertrain. Are you excited for it? Just let me know everything down there and I will catch you guys in the next video. All right, see you later.